So we've got a young quarterback with some experience stepping onto the field today for the first time. Yeah, he's got a lot of talent, and it's just a matter of time until he takes that experience and matches it with all of his talent and becomes one of those guys that we say, hey, the game is going to hinge on him. I think he's very close to that. They face first down. The Raiders line up in the pistol. Get ready. Ellington's taking the handoff. That tackle was made at the 27-yard line. And now let's take a look at the Raiders' offense. They will be expecting far greater efficiency today. A week ago, they turned it over on three occasions. Second down here after that run play. The Raiders come out in the pistol. And Harmon close to getting the interception. And now here's the Patriots defense. Last week, this group came up with three forced turnovers. It's third down coming up. The Raiders pistol set here. He'll fire it out to the left, and he hauls it in. The tackle's made, and the first down is picked up. Yeah, if you want to be a good play-action pass team, it's always nice to have a good running game. Make the defense dig in and try to stop your run. When they do that, you fool them. You fake it, you throw it down the field. That That's... That's about as easy as it gets. The Raiders take it from the 38. Ellington's got it on the handle. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. Second down coming up. They need to get the playoff. He'll throw it over the middle. Gets it out for the completion. Mayo's the one who brings him to the ground. The quarterback see cover four. Four defensive backs playing back against the deep passes. They know they're going to look for underneath or crossing routes. That time, a good throw by the quarterback to the receiver going across the field. Raiders will take the snap from the 45. Still got it after the play action. Good coverage by Harmon that time as the pass goes incomplete. I think, Jim, anytime early in the game, most coaches don't want to take a chance and give momentum to the other football team. So they would punt it in a situation like this. But this one's interesting. Wouldn't shock me also to see the coach go for it on fourth down. The Raiders are set to punt. now having found his mark last week on over 50 percent of his throws tough starting field position here Vereen lined up in the backfield first down and ten Brady out to Shane Vereen. And now that we've got a moment, let's take a look at the Patriots offense. A coach's dream a week ago as this team never turned over the football once. And now they'll try over again on second down. The Patriots come out in a two tight end set. Brady from the gun. Throws to the right. Brady able to find Julian Edelman. And that's a gain of 13. There's no doubt. Time of possession can be an overrated stat in games many times. But one thing you want to do, throw and catch it just like this to pick up those first downs and keep it going.
The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Shane Vereen lined up in the backfield. Here's the handoff, and they'll run it. Browns all over the ball carrier. And now, here's the Raiders' defense. Last week, this group came up with three forced turnovers. After running it, it's second down. Offense lines up here. Snap back to Brady from the gun. And he's taken down. There is nothing worse for a quarterback than have the pocket collapse. And that time he collapsed on his left side. There's nothing he can do. And he goes down for the sack. Third down now. Brady's got everybody split out wide. Snap it out of the gun. Looking to the right side and throwing. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long, they can do just about anything, and it's going to work, and they stop the offense that time. Tackled down at the 32. Of course, Jim, you and I would have called a fair catch there because you know why? We're cowards. Who'd want to take this kind of punishment when the defender's all around you? First down here. There's nothing worse to a quarterback than having an offensive lineman getting driven back in his way. That time, the right side of the line collapses, and it leads to a sack of the QB. Second down. Moore's lined up in the slot. Reaches up to make the catch. Such a bigger window for the quarterbacks to throw the football now to these receivers. They can catch it no matter where you throw it that time. Looks like it's overthrown, but a nice leaping catch. Third and five still to go, even after that last completion. The Raiders in the pistol formation. The give. That's a good tackle, and that's a quick three and out. Raiders running back that time, he makes a bad decision. You can't be looking to make every play a big play when you're running the football. Look for a few yards, take advantage of that. He tries for the big play, what happens? He gets tackled for a loss. back now he'll be punting <laughs> back to the wall for the offense The Patriots come out, jumbo package on the field. And Branch is there to take it down. Second down following the run. The Patriots at the line of scrimmage. Wait, wait, Split wait, wait, backfield. Wait, wait, wait. Gets the handle here. Muscles through the defender. And that's a gain of nine. Green's a great buddy back to have on your football team, isn't he? He goes up in there and gets the first down. Now your offense has three more chances.
They're able to move the chains after that last run. Vereen lined up in the backfield. Brady's going to take the snap from the shotgun. It's right. He's going to be tackled right around the 24-yard line. Things haven't changed from when I played till now. When it's zone coverage, quarterbacks, offensive coordinator, and receivers, they expect a completed pass, and that's what they got in this last play. Nickel formation here for the defense. Here's the handoff brought down at the 26. Nice job that time by the defense. They were ready for the run. Nowhere for the running back to go, and they stop him for a short game. Now looking at third down. They go screen with Ridley. Gets about nine on the play. Don't always have to throw the football pass to yard markers. That's another thing I hate to hear. This time, the offense throws it behind the yard markers on the screen pass. Good execution. They pick up a first down. Shane Vereen lined up in the backfield. First and 10. And now here's the handoff. And Vereen is stopped there. Well, a short gain on the run that time by the offense. When you're running football team, listen, there's going to be a lot of ugly plays that don't work. You just got to keep running it. It's now second down and seven after the three-yard rush. Brady is in the shotgun. He's looking to the right here on this throw. And now will be on the other side of the 50 after this play. Good job by the receiver that time. Getting that extra couple yards, gets a first down. They are marching. Let's see how the defense reacts. Tom Brady under center, out of the eye. It's Vereen, he picks up maybe three. You gotta keep your offensive lineman aggressive, so you have to run the football every once in a while. That run, even though it was a short game, it served a purpose. It's now second down and seven after the three yard rush. Offense lines up here. Brady has got it in the gun. Pass is incomplete. There was no one open. One quarter complete, and we'll take a break as you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. On the way, third down. The defense comes out in the nickel. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. And it's right. Woodson's there that time for the tackle. Good job getting the first down by the offense. And look at the defensive players on the sideline cheering their teammates on. Keep us on the sideline a little longer. That's what they're hoping for. First down here after the completion. This has been a long drive so far. They'll run it here. And Rodgers in on the tackle. Second down here. The long drive continues. Back to the ground. Green inside. And he's tackled, but not until he picked up the first down. Green's a very smart runner. He knows situations in the game. He saw the first down yard markers, and what does he do? He gets past them and picks up the first down. Mounting a serious drive. Now first and ten. Another carry here. And that's a big tackle behind the line of scrimmage. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense. And now they have a good situation. Coming up, second down. 
play after play after play here on this drive. Looks like a false start on the offense. False start. heads to the line for the 13th play of this drive. This long drive continues. The Patriots from the 27. And he's thrown to the ground. I don't know if they were confused or not, but the left side of the offensive line that time, they were not aggressive. They got pushed back and they give up a sack of the quarterback. Third down. What a drive this has been. Shakes off the hit. And the flag comes out. And they'll get to him again for the sack. Personal foul. Baseman. Defense. That's a face mask call, oh, man, and of course, from now on, it's 15 yards no matter how you slice it. They don't even have to interpret it anymore, the severity of it. It's a big penalty. Yeah, it is a big penalty. Uh, you know, one thing, you know why we see a lot of face mask penalties in the NFL now? It's because players tackle too high. Get your arms around the waist. Go down low to make those tackles, and you wouldn't get those face mask penalties. Well, Jim, I threw a lot of passes like that in my career where it should have been intercepted and the guy dropped it, you just go, yes, I got a break. Now can you capitalize on this break? Second down coming up. Marching down the field and taking their time. Brady's going to take it from the gun. Finds his mark. There to make the tackle. Well, it's a nice throw and catch by the quarterback and receiver. Puts them in good position where they have a chance to pick up this third down. Let's see what they do on this third down situation. This has been a long drive so far. It's Ridley. Burnett's able to read that play and make the hit. The Raiders' defense is so fast and so powerful. That time of the run play, they just overpower the offensive line. They tackle the runner for a loss. He'll try this one from 35. They try to convince them otherwise, but that's a false start on the offense. False start. attempt coming up the kick is good there's nothing like being ahead the football game no matter how many points it is because now you can manage it in a different way even though it's early in this game and you make the other team come after you Moore's not going to test the coverage this time as he takes a knee. First down coming up. The Raiders will come out in the pistol. On the money, games 14. Anytime you have a play action pass as a quarterback, make sure you sell that fake and then look up, find that coverage, decide where to throw the football. That was a nice job that time. The Raiders have turned into the cardiac kids. They won a tight one last week, but they trail in this one with time remaining. You've got to be cool under pressure, and I think this is a pressure situation. You've got to make plays when it counts in situations just like this. That's a good job by the quarterback. He read the defense, nothing open deep, so he throws it short, and it puts him in great position for a second down play call. 
It's now second down. The Raiders line up in the pistol offense. The play clock's running down. Ellington's going to take the handoff now. player is down on the field and the training staff comes out and we'll step aside for just a moment. We're back after the injury timeout and Danielle Bellini will have the update on the injury in just a moment. Well that looks like an upper body injury Jim. I think we both can tell that and uh, now the question is how bad is it? Uh, you just never know. Third and two here after the run. The Raiders come out in the pistol. Looking across the middle, tackles made, and that'll move the chains. The catch is made. Quarterback that time realized it was zone coverage. He just waited for the defense to get out of position, and he threw it to the open hole. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Three, three, three. Play clock's running down. Here's the handoff to Maurice Jones-Drew. Milford's the one who made the big stop. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. Well, we're anxious to hear the full story on that injury. Let's go down to Danielle Bellini with the story. Guys, I just spoke with a Raiders official. The team is officially ruling him out for today's game with an upper body injury. Back to you. Second down and 12. Screen. This will just go as an incompletion on the screen. Well, we still got a close game here, and you got to try to keep it that way. It's third long, and you're losing the football game. Don't take a chance on the offensive side. Wait for your next opportunity. Play number six coming up on this drive. Nickel formation for the defense here. The Raiders have it at the 44. Has his target. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. Offense ready now to see what it can do. Double tight end formation. From the gun. Brady able to find Julian Edelman. Edelman is tackled down. Wide receivers get scared sometimes running that slant route. They know their linebackers inside running towards them because they're watching the quarterback's eyes. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Draw play here. Running right through the trenches. And there's only two yards to be found right there. Good job of the defensive line standing in there and fighting. And they hold the running back to a short game. After the two-yard carry, it sets up second down and eight. Coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. After a short delay, now they'll run it. And he's able to get out to the 34-yard line. Personal foul. Face mask. Defense. Boy, if his head got yanked back the other way. An obvious face mask penalty, and that's a big one. It's about safety of the players, too. That's why when you grab, hit the helmet in certain situations, it's going to be a 15-yard penalty. Don't grab the face mask. First and 10. Going to go draw. And a run right up the middle. In this defense, they are tough. When you run that football, they got some men up front. And that time, they stopped that run just for a short game. Oh, 
And it'll be second down and six after the running play on first down. Wide receivers are bunched up. Brady standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. Justin Tuck has a sack. What a good scheme that time by the defense. They confuse the offense. They blitz. They don't know who to pick up. And how about the defender? They must love this. Coming in free and gets a good clean shot on the QB and gets a sack. It's an empty backfield for Brady this time. He'll stand back beyond the center in the gun. He's got the catch. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. This is called managing the football game as a head coach. What are you doing here? You've got a lead. It's close. It's fourth down and short yardage. You're near midfield. Don't do it. Hunt the football away. And if the other team's going to go ahead, make them drive the length of the field. Tough starting spot here for the offense. First down and 10. And that pass is defensed by Harmon. That time, the defender was in excellent position. He jumps up and knocks the ball down. Here we have second down. Moore's a receiver in the slot. Got the completion. McCourty's going to make the tackle. Well, Jim, I always say it's about deception when you're playing offense. That time, the play action fake by the quarterback was so good, the defense didn't even see that he still had the football, and he throws it down there for a nice completion. Away from the ball, there's a flag down on the field. Grabbing the face mask. We see it almost once a week, and here it happens again. Well, a lot of times these defenders, I'll give them a, you know, a little slack because they're running so fast, they're trying to tackle some tremendous athletes in open space. And sometimes, accidentally, you're going to grab the face mask. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. They went with the ground game on first down, bringing up second. Maurice Jones-Drew lined up in the backfield. Handoff made. Middle. Tackle's made, and the first down is picked up. The Raiders call the timeout. They're first. Offense ready for action coming out of their timeout. First down here after the run. Here's the handoff out of the strong eye. And that's a big time tackle that keeps them three yards short of the first down marker. Looks like a penalty on the defense. They come to the line of scrimmage, first down. They'll send it back to the quarterback out of the gun. Revis gets a hand in there and knocks it away. He did everything right, didn't he? The quarterback that time, he was physical. He stayed on the wide receiver. He was reading the quarterback. So it was easy for him to knock the throw down. Jones Drew lined up in the backfield. 
The Raiders take it from the 28. Throws to the right. Rebus nearly comes away with the pick on that pass. The defense did everything right in that situation. They were in the right spot. They were smart. They read the quarterback's eyes, but they dropped the pass. Third down here. Offense trying to pick up the first. Out of the shotgun formation. Throws the pass. Got a hand on it. He'll force the incompletion. Good job by the cornerback. Beat the wide receiver. He is all over him. And it makes it easy for him to swat down the throw by the QB. The kick is good. Well, it ties things up. That's good for the team, no doubt about it. They, they drive down the field to get some positive uh, points out of it by kicking the field goal, but you got to be disappointed, too. To get in that position, not score a touchdown, well, you take what you can get. Sebastian Janikowski lining up for the kickoff. It's McCourty on the return. And the tackle's made right around the 26-yard line. The Patriots will begin their drive from the 26 now. Split backfield here. First and 10. Has his man. Gains maybe five. I think the best thing to say about that play is just a, it gained a few yards, so. That's what you do. All plays don't score. Sometimes you just want to pick up a couple yards. The pass play was good for five. Second and five coming up. Brady from the gun. Down the field. And the pass is picked by Woodson. Good piece of tackling. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled, being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did, they got the interception. Let's go. First down at the 44. That catch, good for a first down. First down here after the completion. Got a flag, takes it from the strong eye. Jones Drew is tackled down. Offside, defense. Players from both sides made an appeal, but the referees say it's on the defense. First down on the way. Jones in the slot. They'll go shotgun here. Finds his mark. Gets about four yards that time. The Raiders call a timeout and are left now with only one. 52-yard field goal attempt coming up. No, it's not. It's a fake. They bring him down at the 29-yard line. So that's going to do it for this first half. We'll be back with our halftime report after the break. This is the Verizon Halftime Report. I'm Larry Ridley. Let's get ready now to take a look back at the first half. Both the Patriots and the Raiders are in a defensive battle right now. 
The scoring is at a minimum, so both teams have to feel like if they can put some drives together, that they'll come away with a win. All right, let's roll those moving pictures. Patriots with it now early in the second. Brady's on time with the slant, and he'll eventually be brought down, but not before getting to the 32-yard line. It'll be a touchback. The Patriots ready to take over the football. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. By 20, by 20. And now here's the first snap of the second half. Has the first down and a whole lot more. And he's tackled down at the 36-yard line. The Patriots offensive line is just whooping some tail today, aren't they? What a job up front. That helps the running back get in space, get down there, and pick up a big game. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Tom Brady under center to the ground. Game's five. The Raiders have been busting through that offensive line and putting pressure on the quarterback from the start. Jim, I would say that you are right. They're, they're busting through, they're running over. Whatever you want, they are getting it done. It's now second down and five after running it on first down. Two tight ends on the field here. Hand off. Nothing there as this goes for a loss of two. The Patriots offensive coordinator, he has to be frustrated by that play. I think he calls the right play, but what happens? The run loses yards. That's just a bad job by the offensive line. The defense comes out of the dime. The Patriots have it at the 39. So that pass is going out of bounds, incomplete. And so now they'll bring out Malone to punt. Got it on the return. Nice tackle. The Raiders offense now marches onto the field. The Raiders lined up in the pistol. The Raiders snap it at the 26. Interception. In on the stop. Hey, is such an impressive athlete. We know he can tackle and stop the run game, but how about that in the pass game? Defending the pass and picking it off. Good job. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. Brady's back in shotgun formation. He'll throw it over the middle. Dragged to the ground. Looks like he's still about a yard short of the first. Well, he had all day long to throw the football that time. That's why he had success throwing the football down the field. I'll tell you what, this defense, they need to start blitzing this quarterback. That was a nice reception, but not enough for the first down. Second down coming up. An extra tight end on the field for this one. Snap back to Brady from the gun. The Patriots now move the chains. Good play call that time by the offensive coordinator. Down inside, when you're inside that 20-yard line or the red zone, find ways to complete the pass 
They did that time. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. They'll go ground. Breaks the tackle. Power surge. Touchdown. Just an awful job, wasn't it, by the defense? I mean, it's first and goal. Well, you know it's going to be a run, or I think you should be playing run. The defense not ready. They get overpowered, and they give up the running touchdown. And the extra point is good. The Patriots' defense once again setting up that score. Turnover points cashed in by the offense. Steven Gostowski's readying his team for the kickoff. Gets out past the 20 and brought down at the 24. First down here. It's a two tight end formation. Incomplete. That was Revis on the coverage. Well, the quarterback that time tried to squeeze it into tight coverage, but no can do. The coverage is too good. The football falls incomplete. They bring in the extra tight end. Second and ten. Maurice Jones-Drew gets it here. And this will end up as a two-yard loss. Pass rushers, defensive players, they love situations like this, don't they? They got a little lead there. It's in the second half, and it's third and long. You are expecting pass, so you can just let it go and try to get after the quarterback. Third down on the way. For this play, they'll go with two tight ends. Trying to beat the play clock. Can't find a mark. 
and this is going to bring up fourth down. Short series this time for the offense. All set to punt here. Better be careful here. Terrible starting field position here for the offense. Tom Brady under center. Now first and ten. They'll run it. Here's the handoff. Tackle just three yards short of the first. Here at offensive lineman, and you can line up and just run the football straight ahead and pick up those kind of yards. You are going to get into the head of the defense. You're basically saying we're tougher than you are, and we're just going to come right at you. We'll go ground. He's tackled beyond the markers. It's a first down. Well, the defense, they give up a first down there. They're behind. They just can't sit back there and keep bending. You got to take some chances, go on the offensive, on the defensive side, and just make things happen. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Right back to him once more. They'll mark him at the 22. Well, I know it's not going to make a highlight film, but still a good solid run up in there for a couple yards. Second down after going to the ground game, the first play. Brady's got two tight ends on the field for this snap. It is Ridley. He's headed right. An open lane. Ridley rips off a long one. Well, here we are in the second half of a tight game, and you, you always hear this control the tempo of the game, just move the chains, and that's what the offense did that time. Picked up the first down and just keep marching. Away. First and ten. Set up screen. That's a nice route on the outside. Nice throw by the quarterback. Puts him in good position to keep moving and get a first down. Pass complete, but did not get them the first, so it's second down now. Brady, handoff, and he's tackled down after picking up the first. Well, that's just a good old physical run by the offense there, and it's good for a few yards and gets him another first down. First down here after the run. Offense lines up here. He's going to get another carry. Marine off the left side. Here's a stat line that comes as a surprise to no one, Phil. This running back getting it done once again on the ground. No surprise, that is right. Listen, this team practices the running game. They are tough. That's why they get it done week in and week out. Here they come, back to the line after picking up over 20 yards on that last play. Rock for a loss on that play. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. This will be the eighth play of this drive. Ridley lined up in the backfield. The Patriots take it from the 28. And Ridley... March down the field, and you add on to that lead with a touchdown. It's fun to watch the other team. Will they stay patient, or will they panic? My bet is they'll panic. The Patriots line up now for the point after. 
And the point after is good. Patriots now getting ready to kick it away. Able to move past the 20 and brought down at the 23. The Raiders bring their offense back onto the field for their next drive. Maurice Jones-Drew lined up in the backfield. First down at the 23. Maurice Jones-Drew. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. This will be second down. Let's go. Go for the end. Go. Looking across the middle and incomplete pass that time as he threw it short. It'll be third down. They come out in the dime package. Out of the shotgun. Out to the left. Incomplete. And this is going to be a three and out. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long. They can do just about anything that's going to work. And they stop the offense that time. Patriots will begin their drive from the 26 now. Tom Brady under center. First down and 10. Takes it from the eye. And the tackle is made at the 35-yard line. You see the matchup in running back, and while only one side has really been able to count on that run game, it's still a very close game. Yeah, it is, Jim. Close game here, and also that can happen when you talk about run games. They're going to go up and down, and if you're having trouble running the football, then change the direction of your offense. Do something else. The Patriots will take the snap from the 35. Almost made the catch, but the collision jarred it loose this man was put on this defense for this reason alone make the big hits give your team some momentum and also put a little fear in the offensive players when they get the football the patriots will take the snap from the 35 he'll go to the left that picks up seven and with these numbers, I think you saw a running back who was upset with the way he played last week and wanted to correct things today, Phil. Yeah, we're seeing a guy very determined. It was a bad week last week, and Jim, we know you have a couple bad weeks in a row from the running back position in this league. You can lose your job, and he said that's not going to happen. He's out there playing hard today. It's Brady down the field. Tough catch. Patriots in the end zone. Take advantage of situations like this. Not often in the NFL do you get somebody this wide open. Good job by the receiver. Nice job by the quarterback seating. And what do you get? An easy touchdown pass. The Patriots now will tack on the extra point. Extra point was good. 
The Raiders will now be in an even deeper hole here as they get ready to return the kick. Scores 24 to 3. Patriots now getting ready to kick it away. Just across the 20 and tackled at the 21. The Raiders offense heads on to the field. Jones Drew lined up in the backfield. First and 10. Jones Drew's hand at the football. After being stuffed at the line of scrimmage, it's now second down and 10. Double tight end formation. And he's forced to the ground. That's a bad job that time. There's no doubt about it. The blitz by the defense, they do not do a good job of finding out where everybody's blitzing from. They let a guy come free, and that free blitzer, or as we call them, free runners, he gets the hit on the QB and takes him down. The Raiders will approach this play from out of the pistol. One quarter to go, and you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. You're not you when you're losing. Grab a Snickers and get back in the game. It's third and 17 here after the sack. Maurice Jones-Drew lined up in the backfield. He'll take the snap, the first here in the fourth quarter. Makes the reception. They bring him down, and the offense fails to pick up a first down on three plays. Both secondaries have really stepped up today, Phil. Yeah, they have. It's so hard to be a defensive back in the NFL to cover some of the fastest runners in the world to do that. And also, we know they can't touch them either, so they're having an outstanding day. Amendola is going to look for space now. And they are in on Amendola. <laughs> the Patriots are getting set for their next possession. Offense lines up here. First down at the 43. Here's the handoff and they'll run it. And he's going to be tackled right around the 43. Looking ahead, the Patriots will be on the road in Kansas City next week, while the Raiders will be playing at home next week. That leads us to second down. Play action fake, looking to throw. This pass is incomplete that was thrown right into double coverage quarterbacks love to see a receiver uh, have this type of play even though he doesn't make the catch the effort is outstanding and he's given everything he has to make that catch offense lines up here third and ten keeps it here reaches out and grabs it Another third down conversion. The offense continues to come through in the clutch. The Raiders have counted on this defense to keep them in games this year, but so far that unit has been absolutely manhandled. Yeah, this is a game they are not used to, that is for sure. And what you're doing on the defensive side, you get in that huddle and you just want somebody to make a play to turn this game around and get your defense off the field. The give. That's good for only a yard or two. Phil, today we've seen a running back who was putting up some big rushing totals. Jim, sometimes I get tired of talking about the quarterbacks and wide receivers, how well they're doing. What a good change of pace to watch the game evolve around a running back. And man, this guy is taking advantage of those opportunities. That time, that's just a bad decision by the running back. He makes the wrong read. The offensive line blocked it right. 
But when you make the wrong read, you're going to get tackled. That time he gets tackled for a loss. This is third down. Tom Brady under center. Ridley's going to secure the handoff. He's got some daylight. He's going to be tackled right around the 21-yard line. That's an awesome job by the offense, picking up this first down here in the second half. They've got a big lead. It's not about scoring anymore. It's just about milking that clock, and that is an art, and this team is good at it. First down at the 21. Gives it to him again. Burnett's there to make the tackle. Jim, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. They're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. Second down here after that run play. Right, a tight end, but now shifted into the backfield. Brady's going to take the snap from the shotgun. It's right, and they'll end up losing four here. The defense has got to be a little aggressive here. Your team is down. You've got to attack this offense. You don't want them to get in there and get another score. Brady is in the shotgun. And it's out of bounds, incomplete. Thirty-six yard field goal attempt coming up. It converts on the three. Well, Jim, that was a nice kick. It is right down the middle. This guy is so accurate. And it's you could drive the golf ball like that. You might be a good golfer, but what a kick by this guy. He is a machine. Touchback now as the ball comes out to the 20. They come to the line, and it's first down. Let's go! Three, three, three. Ah. Reese is taking the handoff. He's tackled right at the 24. The Patriots lead, and all you have to do is look at the turnover ratio, and that tells the story, Phil. It sure does, and listen, everybody calls them turnovers. Well, let's look at this game here. I call it takeaways. They are taking the football away from the offense. What a job by the defense. Play action. Should have had it. Reese is going to go back to the huddle and look at all his teammates and go, my bad. Well, they know it's your bad. Everybody, even the offensive linemen, they saw you were open and you dropped the pass that was right to you. But, hey, that's the way it goes. You know, you got to keep the confidence up. I think he will. And I'm sure the football will find its way towards him again soon. The offense now needs to pick up the first here on third down after that incompletion. Three, Jones three, Drew go. lined up in the backfield. Brandon Browner with the interception. That brings the play to an end. That was an awesome job by the defense. They just read the quarterback's eyes. They got in position, and they made the interception. Now first and ten. Gets the handle here. Then picks up about three. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they come up with a play that fools the defense. Second down now. Nickel formation here for the defense. Ridley takes it out of the eye. Got a flag down here. Personal foul. Facement. Defense. 
That's a face mask call. And of course, for now on, it's 15 yards no matter how you slice it. They don't even have to interpret it anymore. The severity of it, it's a big penalty. Yeah, it is a big penalty. Uh, you know, one thing, you know why we see a lot of face mask penalties in the NFL now? It's because players tackle too high. Get your arms around the waist. Go down low to make those tackles. It makes the catch. Touchdown. Well, the offensive line did it all in this drive, didn't they? Here it is on first and goal. Nice job of passing. And the quarterback finds the open receiver for the touchdown. The Patriots for the extra point. Count it. The Patriots have their defense to thank for those points. That interception setting up the score that the offense was able to finish off. The Raiders ready to return the kickoff. Moore is going to run this one out. Reading for the snap. The Raiders come to the line of scrimmage and Let's empty go. out the backfield. Everyone split out wide. Throws the pass. Ball's thrown incomplete. Great coverage there by the defense. There's a difference. When you play zone, you drop back and you watch the quarterback and you react to the football. When you're playing man-to-man, -man, all you're worried about... Where that receiver goes, you try to shadow him, look for the football, and try to make a play. Jones Drews lined up outside on the right. Dropping back now into the shotgun. Makes the catch. He's brought down at the 23-yard line. Easy to say that if your quarterback isn't having his best game, that sometimes it can be hard to overcome that. So kudos to the defense. But you know this is a quarterback who expects more from himself. You're right, Jim. Let's give credit to the defense. They've been really good today here in this game. But also, when you look at the offensive side, when you see a quarterback struggle, it always means this. Protection by the offensive line has been average. Wide receivers not getting the job, getting the job done. And that's why this football team is behind. Delay of game, offense. Still third down. Third down after the penalty. Two tight ends on the field here. Let's go. From the gun. Has 
Jones. That's a huge third down conversion, especially after all the failures leading up to this point. Well, you're really in a tough spot, but that is a good job picking up the first down. You're down big in the second half. All you can do, just keep picking up those first downs. You hope it leads you to a score, and then you play the game from there. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Jones Drews, a receiver all the way out to the right. They better hurry to get the snap. From the shotgun, secures it with two hands. Brought down by Mayo. That's second down coming up. The Raiders lined up. Everybody split out wide. They'll hike it to him out of the shotgun. And Harmon close to getting the interception. I know we've all heard this phrase before. That's why they're playing defense, because they can't catch. Hey, the coaches don't care about that. When you get an opportunity, they want you to make the catch. It's third down coming up. The Raiders will go with the pistol on this play. Here's the handoff to Maurice Jones-Drew. They knock him down behind the line of scrimmage. The Patriots have figured out a way to finally slow down a running game. It's been a big point of contention for them all season long. Thankfully for them today, they figured it out. Yeah, they have. You know, listen, these defensive linemen all year long, all they've wanted to do is rush the quarterback. But today, they've settled in, they're being tough, and they're stopping to run. Good job. Amendola is going to make the fair catch this time. It's first down as they head to the line. Tom Brady under center. Here's the handoff, trying to fight through right up the middle of the field. After running it, it's second down. It's Ridley looking out wide. And he's taken down, but not until he picks up the first. All right, coaches, don't get greedy. Be decisive over there on the sideline. Do what's best for your football team. Keep getting those first downs and letting that clock just keep running. You got a big lead here in the second half. Don't take any chances. It is Ridley to the right side. Ridley's tackled down. This is one good tackling defense. They stay in good position at all times, and we saw it that time, and they stopped the play for a short game. Two minutes to go before this one's in the books. We return out of the two-minute warning. Fourth quarter action. Second down coming up. Offense lines up here. They'll run it here. And they tackle them there at the 34. If you want to run the football with success, you're going to have plays like this where they pick up very little yardage. Don't listen to the fans. Keep running it, and it'll work. The Patriots have it at the 34. He'll get it again. Breaks at the tackle. Good job on the ground there by Stephen Ridley. Well, how about that, Jim? Not a surprise. Down the red zone one more time. They're blowing them out. And this offense has been spectacular. What will they do here? You know what? I think they'll just run it and try to end this game. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Here they
they come back to the line after the 50-yard gainer on the previous play. They tackle him for a loss. Got to give the defense some credit on first down. There's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. And now they'll try over again on second down. One more play, and it's in the books. Well, Phil, I know it wasn't really popular when I said it back at the broadcast center in New York, but I said it early. This is a blowout, and I know I probably turned a few television sets off, but you had to call it like it is. Yeah, it really was. Total domination. You don't see it too often in the NFL, but this is what it was. You just got beat, out hit, out everything went against you, and that's why you got blown out. What a memorable game this truly was. For Phil Simms, Danielle Bellini, and Larry Ridley, Jim Nance saying so long for now, and we leave you with the GMC Never Say Never moment of the game.